The year is 1877, and trouble is brewing in the great Southwest. The natives are restless. The cavalry is anxious. The miners are thirsty. The temperance ladies are up in arms. Why? Because 40 wagons full of whiskey are heading west along the Hallelujah Trail. And so are Bert Lancaster, the cool colonel. I don't wish to intrude on your privacy, Colonel, but this is vitally important. I'm taking a bath. Well, the sight of a gentleman taking his bath is not far unto a woman who's been widowed twice. You forgive me if I don't get up. Lee Remick, the hot-tempered temperance lady. And if we are to respect man, then we must save man from himself and from the poison of alcoholic spirits. Jim Hutton, the agitated adjutant. Chief says, no more peace. Pamela Tiffin, the colonel's delectable daughter. Donald Pleasance, the unpredictable oracle. The chief says he wants uh, 20 wagons of uh, mini uh, crazy water. 20 wagons of whiskey? That chief, uh, he's a real boozer, Colonel. Brian Keith, the irascible wagon master. You better smash a barrel, one barrel, and I'll have those brass buttons ripped off your chest in the very halls of Congress. Now, I'm a taxpayer and a good Republican. You'll say that one more time, Mr. Wallingham, and I'll bust you right in the nose. And when they meet, all hallelujah breaks loose along the Hallelujah Trail.